Hey everyone, welcome to Coding Dots. My name is Karthik Rathor and today we are going to learn how can we switch to another link or another app uh, when someone click on our uh, text view image button or anything. Okay, so uh, what will happen when someone click on it, visit site, uh, whatever site we will uh, write in the code, it will take you there. Okay okay so if we will write google.com so it will ask us which browser we want to use if you have multiple browser in your phone and then you can choose your browser and it will take you there so what i have done to save your time i have already created one text view over here and as you can see uh, this uh, include this text also widget site and uh, in manactivity.java what i have done i already created one function for you here go to url and this uh, uh, what is happening here we are passing one string in it okay so what will happen whenever someone click on it so it will take uri and uh, use uh, it will create an object of it and we can pass this uh, URI, ob uri object uh, while we start our activity okay so as you know intent intent is uh, more we use to switch between screens but now we are going to use it switching between applications also okay so uh, you can just pass uh, your string here also okay directly but what we are uh, doing right now we are just creating a function this s string we will get we are passing it here and all the work will be managed by intent okay so for now i'm just importing these uh, you can also import uh, okay alt plus enter for shortcut and get application context okay so now what we have to do uh, we already created this text view just we just need to link it with the, this web uh, text view over here so web equal to find view by id uh, dot id dot web link okay and i'm just putting one set on click listener on it so we can make it clickable so you can simply make anything clickable image also and button also i'm using text view okay so uh, what it will, it will do it will uh, call our function go to url and you can pass your url here so i i'm just simply passing www.google.com okay so it will open google okay let's run our application uh, just one thing more uh, you can just simply add this thing uses permission also so you will face no problem you can use internet permission okay so let's run it again and let's see uh, how it will behave here okay so uh, let it run okay uh, it is not launched automatically okay so as you can see uh, it is already uh, opened now if i will click on this and i will open with chrome it will take me to google okay and uh, and if you think uh, it is already open so i'm simply searching anything and now we are doing it again uh, if uh, in any case it is already open so let's do it again and now again go I'm going to it and it is, it is taking me to google.com okay so you can pass any URL here it will take you to that URL you can pass uh, your Instagram ID here so it will take you to your Instagram app uh, in the Instagram app then in your profile also you can choose your app also okay so uh, this is very simple tutorials we are starting with uh, currently and we have some big bigger plans also big surprises plans also for bigger projects and very exciting projects also uh, but uh, have some patience starting with very uh, very lower steps and then we will take our bigger steps so uh, do not forget to subscribe and please do like this video and stay connected with us because we have a lot things for you so thanks a lot for watching this video bye bye and have a good day